Hey, Randy here for Gold Midwest Fishing. We're about to do a lake review on Pear Lake. It's just west of Minong off Highway 77. Uh, lake I haven't been to yet, so it'll be brand new for me. Reggie's going with me too. Here's the landing at Pear. You come down this little gravel road. It's kind of a little offshoot there. And uh, water looks a little high, but uh, that's pretty much all it is right here. Got a little area to pull in there to back in your boat, but it ain't much. This is all you get. And I'm guessing you park up on top of the hill behind me. And in case you're wondering, there's no parking here. It's a fire lane. <laughs> There's just a little uh, road that comes off Highway 77 here, just a little dead end road, and it goes down there to the landing. And I don't know, I guess I'm going to park right there, the road just ends, so. Highway. So, yeah, there's really no other parking spot, so. There's not too many people here. The only one, so probably won't be a problem unless it's a weekend. Maybe there might be a couple. And like most of these lakes, they got odor advisories. You see bluegills? <laughs> right there. All right, it's another landing you're gonna get your feet wet because the, there's no dock and it's kind of shallow. Oh, yeah, tiny little bluegills. I see them. Oh, there's bigger bluegills. Oh, I thought they were, I saw little ones. Oh, there's some bigger ones. There. No, no, they take forever to dry out. <laughs> oh, you just see them all jump. Oh yeah, there's definitely small ones in here. There we got one. Oh, that's a little better. What do we got? What do we got? Oh yeah. So there are some decent ones in here. There he is. And another little one. So three little ones, one big one. Maybe it's time to try for some bass. Ooh. Bass. Look, there is. <laughs> yeah, some bass in here. Hey, buddy. Yeah, not real big, but it's fun. Oh, <laughs> he got caught in my line. How'd you do that? Look at that. <laughs> All right, oh, there he is. Of course he did. You get to see what it was. So we're out on this uh, little second hump out in the middle. Bunch of lily pads out there. Probably a bass around it, I'm guessing.
There he is. Bluegills. They're everywhere in this lake. Not a bad one. Oh, they are fatty. Yeah, decent sized bluegill. Yeah, it seems like you can just throw a line anywhere. <laughs> So I just got my pole just dangling over the back end of the boat here and the blue guys are attacking it. Where did I win? Eh, that's what I get. Just leave it hang over the side and catch these little guys. So this is the very south end, the skinny end of the pair. This is a really cool house back here. And there's a bunch of lily pads and stuff. Catching little bluegills in there, but not much else. Now Reggie's going to show us how to catch one. Getting bigger. Hey, you do a bass. Look at that. Good one. Oh, on his tiny little fisherman for bluegills with his little jiggy. <laughs> <laughs> Lively one. It's a fighter. It's a real fighter. It's not a bass. Oh, biggest one we caught in here yet. He's, yeah, he's palm sized. <laughs> that one ain't bad either. A couple eaters. Oh, northern. There's a northern in here. What? Whoa, he's a feisty one too. as big as everything else we've caught. Yeah. You lay down right there, we'll do some surgery on you. Oh, oh no no I said I said lay down. Well, he just made it worse. No, he actually made it better. Here. Okay, you lay there nice. Grab this hook and shake you off. Alright. We now know there's bass, northern, and bluegill in here. Caught him on the one minus again. Super steep shoreline right here. I mean, we're in 18 feet of water and we're only 50 feet from shore, so. All right, do I need to motor us into the landing? Or? Jumping back in. All right, that was Pear Lake. A fun little lake. It's not real big. It's really big here on the north end. I think it's small on the south end. Looks like a pear, basically. Uh, bluegills, pretty much anywhere you throw a line, you could catch bluegills. Um, not real big. Uh, we had a couple bigger ones in there, but most of them were really small. Uh, lots of bass and I caught one tiny little northern so they are in there. It'd be a good place if you have like small kids and they want like non-stop action because you can these cars anytime you throw out a line you can pretty much catch a little bluegill so little kids would have fun but if you're a serious fisherman and want to catch some nice fish probably not the lake for you but there's lots of action on the bluegills if you want it. 
you want more information, just go, go to GoMidwestFishing.com. Go to the lake review section. You'll see it under there under Pear Lake. Or just click the link in the description below and it'll take you directly there. All right, everyone. Thanks for watching.